Bro, keep making the beast, man. OG Bo Beats. Yo, yo, what's happening? It's your man, OG Bo Beats TV. Coming to you today, another special video. What's good? What's happening, YouTube? It's your man, OG Bo Beats, and I'm back with another video for you today. So today, um, I'm just coming out the gym, so excuse my attire. You know what I'm saying? I'm still a little wet from the sweat. Got a good workout in on this Saturday morning. Kind of sunny day, so it should be a good day today. Um, I want to talk to you all about crypto. All right, crypto has been in the news a lot. It's starting to bubble back up. A lot of people are starting to talk about crypto again. And you can tell that people are starting to get FOMO again because a lot of the crypto is going up. So we're going to talk about that. Um, but before we do, please make sure if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, like the video, share the video. I'm going to make this one quick. So let's get right into it. Boom. All right, boom, so check it out, so check it out. So, crypto, all right, so uh, a lot of people had left crypto out for dead. I seen a lot of people making posts about crypto was a scam, um, laughing at people, a lot of naysayers. Mainly, this was the people that thought um, that they could jump in the, in the crypto space and get rich. They thought it was a get rich quick scheme. They thought it was like uh, playing the mega millions. And in some, in some, cases it, it could have been like that for people had you had bought a uh, dodge coin at a certain time you would have caught the run up you could have made a lot of money had you had a bought ethereum at a certain time bitcoin all of that you could have made a lot of money i'm gonna give you all this gem right here and i'm gonna make this one short it's about patience just like the stock market the crypto market is about patience all right you got to be patient take your time you know, make a solid investment and, and just let it do what it's going to do. That's my philosophy. Um, just like with the stock market, you know what I'm saying? But crypto is a little different. We still a little weary about crypto and what's going to really happen to it, what the SEC is going to do to regulate it. We're still working on all of that. But for now, you can invest um, a small amount, I would say. Now, I'm not telling you to buy, hold, or sell any crypto. I'm just telling you what I do. Small amount. At one point, I did have a, a decent amount of crypto. And I still have a lot of, not a lot of, I have Bitcoin, Solano, Mana uh, on the Crypto.com app along with the Crow Coin. On my Webull app, I have uh, uh, some Cardano, all right, some ADA. And then on my Robinhood app, I have uh, uh, some Dogecoin. All right, so I've been holding on, holding on because I truly believe that crypto is going to eventually blow back up. I just do. All right, I've been dealing with crypto for, for quite a while and I've seen it go down and seen it go up. I seen in 2020 when the pandemic hit, everybody jumped into trying to get rich quick and all these different money schemes. So a lot of people jumped in head first, listening to other people that didn't know what they was talking about. And then when they didn't make money or lost money, then they they, they talked down on the whole you know platform. So it is what it is. All right, so all I'm saying is patience is key. When it comes to dealing with the stock market, with crypto, with any investment, or right, you make a smart investment based off of research, fundamentals, it's hard to necessarily look at crypto. So you, it was as far as fundamentals, but you got to look at the history of crypto and some of the coins. And if you're gonna buy crypto, I would recommend putting some money in Bitcoin, putting some money in Ethereum, putting some money in in some of the bigger name coins. All right, you can go to Coin Market Cap. Look at the top 10, top 20. Those may be an option, all right? But again, I'm not telling you what to do, all right? The bottom line is crypto is going back up. It's an article that just came out today in Benzinga.com talking about crypt, uh, Bitcoin broke that 21,000 psychological barrier. As you know, Bitcoin was just 16,000 or, you know, it was, it was straggling at 16, 17 for a while. That was a good opportunity for some people to get in if you don't know, um, because I still think that it's going to go back to, you know, a, a quite a bit of or close to where it was at when it hit the 68,000, if not more, eventually. Patience is key. All right. And because of Bitcoin going up, so did Solano, so did Mana, so did Gala, um, so did APT. So I'm going to show y'all, uh, other than this article, it's this app called Crypto Bubble. It's a pretty cool app and it basically has all the coins, a lot of coins floating around in bubbles and the bigger bubbles show you the uh the ones that went up with the higher percentage all right or the ones that's going up so it's a cool app 
check that out. I'm gonna show y'all a little screenshot of that. Um, but I just want to talk about crypto, man. I got crypto on crypto.com app. All right, the same crypto.com that has that contract with the with the LA Lakers that took over the Staples Center. And I think they have another contract with another NBA team, um, maybe Philly. But either way, um, crypto.com app. I use Robinhood. I use Webull, and you know what I'm saying. I make solid investments. I add a little bit here and there, and I'm just waiting for the time. I'm not in a rush, right? If I need that money, I'll take the money, but I'm not in a rush for crypto to blow up. I got time. You got time, all right? You got to be patient when it comes to making money, when it comes to investing. But hey, that, that's all. That's my word. That's all I want to give y'all for today, man. It's a nice day. I'm going to get, get home, get dressed, headed to the uh, Charlotte Hornets game tonight. So that should be good. This your man, OG Bo Beats, man. Make sure you subscribe to the channel, like the video, share the video, leave a comment down below. Talk to me about crypto. Let me know what you got going. If you still invested, if you took your money out, whatever the case may be. Until the next time, I'm out. Peace.